but it's not sometimes the results I want you to be able to hit it solid mm -hmm. and the way you have it right now the way you're chipping is go ahead and set up okay it's naturally gonna go this way okay? mm -hmm. so if you do this and you really trust gravity you're gonna hit behind the ball mm -hmm. so if you hit behind it you're gonna hit it heavy yeah. or you're gonna hit it thin yeah because your yeah. body's going oh no <laughs> oh. it's gonna lift There you go. Okay. Now, let's not do a forward press. Okay. Let's do this. There you go. There you go. Feel like I practice like I have to take it back to the parallel line from my body. Yeah. So but you. It, it didn't. No. Go that way. Yeah. Uh. You can't do what you think you're doing or seeing. So what you see, feel, and watch are separate things. That's it. Bend your knees, sit back. Better, huh? Yeah. Okay, now when you take it back, you're reverse pivot right here, okay? You don't want to reverse pivot. I like it. Yeah, so you have to sit back, sit down, and you can't go, you gotta go this way. You can't go. This See the turn? Just right there. Natural press. Okay? That's it. That's good. Let's do that again. Balls on the right side? Yeah, a little bit on the right side. Yes. That's it. Even if you miss it, look at it. You will see this more clearly when I put his before and after swing side by side. But I want you to notice his posture and his balance are off. And as he swings the club back, his head goes towards the golf ball. You will notice his posture and balance is a lot better and his head is more stable throughout the swing. Keep in mind this was his very first tripping lesson with me. Hopefully he stays on this fundamental path so he can continue to improve. In the golf swing you never want to fix what's obvious. So when his head is moving like that, even my dogs Armani and Jay can see that, and you don't want to fix what's obvious. Basically you don't want to hold his head still and tell him to swing. We worked on everything else, but keeping the head still. When you address the root cause of any issue, it ends up fixing a lot of other things that you don't need to try to fix. 